Hello and welcome to Gray Main Gaming. My name, of course, is Gray Main. Thank you for joining me in this new intro video. I like to uh, refresh the intro every year or so just to keep it, you know, updated. And uh, so consider this to be the, you know, the freshening of this <laughs> of this intro video. Uh, I'm doing it from the Dreamlight Valley backdrop. It's one of the uh, it's one of the games that I play the most of, uh, and it's got a lovely like setting. So um, I started this channel a couple of years ago uh, in the hopes of combining two of my great loves in life. One uh, is gaming, of course. I've been doing that since I was a kid, so a long time ago. And the other. Uh, is uh, animal activism, which uh, is dear to my heart, you know, trying to network enough to uh, help out animals in animal shelters. That was my main goal. And that, of course, is not just in the United States, but around the world. Um, <laughs> and it's very rewarding, especially when people that are close to you, that become close to you through the networking of places like YouTube and such, uh, um, uh, can see where you're coming from, you know, they just get you and a lot of my subscribers, you know, they just get me We talk about it quite a bit uh, And I saw YouTube as probably the fastest way to be able to network and get the word out and uh, Try to help these animals uh, in other states and other countries if I could uh, because if you saw the numbers of uh, of animals that we euthanize every year just in the United States, because of overpopulation of our shelters, uh, it would surprise you. Uh, and there are reasons for that. Uh, the reason, you know, the number one reason for overpopulation is because we do not spay and neuter our pets enough. Um, uh, you know, it's just, uh, uh, you know, we, we have to euthanize thousands and thousands and thousands of pets every year, healthy pets that have done absolutely no wrong. The only the only thing that they did was you know was end up being born in the wrong place at the wrong time. And uh, you know when you know when a person leaves their dog to be uh, you know to have you know have their puppies at will, um, you know they might end up keeping one puppy and then bringing three to the shelter. Uh, so what happens though when you know when a cat pair is left to have kittens? Well, if you look at the uh, at the stats on on cats on uh, on adult pair uh, uh, through the course of age one to age seven, so that's only you know that's only it's under half of their life one to seven uh, on adult pair of cats age one to seven has the capability of producing 420,000 kittens um, not by them you know I mean not like we're talking about their generations so once they have a litter they can have up to three litters a year I think and each of those letters say has three or three or four kittens then all those kittens start having kittens and then all those kittens start having kittens you know, and it's just a, an endless uh, cycle unless you put an end to it, unless you spay and neuter those cats. You're saving hundreds of thousands of lives by just spending a couple hundred dollars to get your cats. If your cats are, you know, out and you know, out roaming and stuff. Uh, yeah, you could save that many kittens lives. This is why our, our uh, shelters are overpopulated. So... This is what this channel is for. It's a network, and uh, I often ask people how they can uh, donate to my channel. You can't. There's no way. I don't have any kind of link. I don't ask for your money. I never will ask for your money. I've, I've had people do it. And um, I always tell them the same answer, and it's the same answer. I see, like, <laughs> my dog's going to bark now. <laughs> Uh, I won't ask for your money. I ask that you take your money if you would like and go and uh, donate it to your local shelter. And if you can't donate money, then donate your time. Go walk a dog, go hold a cat, 
spend some time at your local shelter, help them out. I can almost guarantee they need and would welcome your help. Uh, and if you can't do that, then maybe drop off a bag of dog or cat food, some cat litter, some food, some blankets, some toys. Anything you can do to help out your local shelter. And I try to uh, incentivize that by, you know, if you do that, and I have some people who have already um, who have already um, done this, uh, I I've said that if you do any of that, if you go drop food off, drop off a blanket, go walk a dog, uh, on your honor, come back and tell me in the comments, and the next day I will wear a dress for the next video and uh, tell everyone about your donation so that was how i in you know incentivized that and a couple people took me up on it and i wore a dress a couple times <laughs> in the in the video so so that's uh you know so i'd like to get out there i like to uh you know to network on youtube that is what i do uh and i play games i'm not a great game player let's be honest but i try and I'm about positivity, you know. I had, you know, this is a family channel. I'm about positivity, uh, positivity, and it's also safe for children. I have made this channel safe for children and safe for you because I don't allow trolls in here uh, between my shows. So, you know, when I do my daily show, I'll, you know, I'll read your comments, but the comments um, are locked until the next morning and I read through them before uh, I allow them to be seen on the channel and anyone that's trying to troll or harass someone I will delete them before anyone sees it only person who sees comments until I unlock them is me and uh, if you're negative in any way um, I will delete your comment that's just the way this channel is it's a family channel and I will not let internet trolls try to ruin uh, the harmony uh, and peace that we have on this channel and many of my viewers and my uh, my longtime subscribers will attest to that that uh, there's no one that's been attacked on this channel and uh, or been harassed because it's just not ever gonna happen so if you're a troll this is probably where you want to stop the video and move along because no one's gonna see your video or your comments but me and you know I'll just laugh at them and delete them that's all that'll happen so um, so that's about it. That's the intro video on to what this channel is about. There's a lot of people that'll come on here and say, I thought this was a gaming channel. Well, no, it's been on, it's been on the, uh, uh on the intro for a long time. And, uh, you know, that this is why this channel was created. Sorry, my phone is ringing there, but I had to turn it off. <laughs> Just as I'm ending too. But, uh. Yeah, so that uh, that's what this channel is. It's it, it's a mixture of gaming and of networking animals. So I hope you'll stay. I hope you'll join us. We have fun. We're, I'm here every morning at 3 a.m. on the daily show for Dreamlight Valley. I play World of Warcraft. Uh, I play uh, a few other games that are are in the channel, and uh, we'll continue to do so. I'll be here every morning. 3 a.m. Eastern Time for their, the Dreamlight Valley Daily Show. I wonder where they uh, their ice. What did you say? I thought he said eyes. I think he said ice. Yeah, it was ice. I, I was like, what are they talking about? What kind of show is this? Where do, I wonder where they harvest their eyes. <laughs> All right, so that's the intro. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning on the Daily Show.